Hi, I'm Chris Donnelly at Builder by Trade, and today I'm going to show you how to build a woodwork station for your kids. When I was a kid, I had one of these, and it's definitely one of the reasons I became a builder. My boy is eight, and his younger sister is four, so basing it on his leg measurements, I want my table legs to be 650 millimeters. I'm just pre-cutting these to a working size first, then I'll dress them to an exact size later. I put them through the thicknesser to get them to the right profile. Of course, if you don't have these machines at home, you can get them pre-cut to the exact size. The final step for these legs is to cut them to the exact length, and I use the router to round off any sharp edges. The tabletop is going to be 850 by 650 millimeters, and using the same piece of plywood, I can measure out the four sides that I also need. I need two sides at 540 by 120 millimeters, and two sides at 800 by 150 millimeters. My next step is to router the bull nose around the edges of the tabletop and the exposed edges on the sides. Give those a quick sand, get rid of the dust, and then you're ready for assembly. I start with the short sides and I attach them to the legs first. And I'm going 30 millimeters in from each end and making sure it's square as I go. Put your last side on and then you're ready to attach your tabletop. You want to screw that down into the center of the legs. Give your table a good sand all over, then get rid of the dust and wipe it with a damp cloth. We're coating our table with Resine AquaClear Waterborne Urethane Varnish. I want a natural look, but also a surface that's easy to keep clean. The first coat needs up to 10% water added to it. I'm using a paint pad speed brush, which needs a rinse before using. So who wants to pour it in? Me! Me. Thoroughly paint the bottom of your table then turn it over carefully and paint the top. Leave that to dry, then apply a second coat. This time, you don't need to add water. After that, you can add as many more coats as you want. You can create anything you want to with your woodwork station. Now I'm expecting some apprentices in the future.